Hi guys, my name is Tanmoy and welcome to another session of Study PPC. Today we are going to look at how to create automated rules inside the Google Ads account. Automated rules lets you make changes in your Google Ads account based on certain settings and conditions which you set. With the help of these rules, you can set up some statuses on your ad status. You can change the ad status, your bids, budgets and more. There are different types of automated rules which you can create inside the Google Ads account. So let's begin and let's look at some of them and see how we can make use of it. In order to use rules inside Google Ads account, guys, we have to go to the tools section. Under tools, you have bulk actions where the second option you will get is rules. Now from here, you will be able to create different types of automated rules. So in order to do so, you can click on the plus button. And these are all the different types of rules which you can create inside the Google Ads account, guys. So let's look at some of them which we can make use of. Let's start with campaign rules. Let's say I want to create a rule for my campaigns wherein I want to make sure that if any of my campaign reaches a certain spend, then the campaign should get paused automatically. I want to create this rule because I want to keep a check on the spend happening on my campaign and I want to put a cap on that. So for which we can go ahead and create a rule over here. So the first thing which we have to do here is we have to name the campaign. And then you can choose the action to be applied on this campaign. So as we are discussing, we want to pause this campaign. You can apply these changes to all the campaigns in the account or you can select specific ones from here. Now we are coming to the condition which we want to set. Now as we said that we want to put a condition that the cost go if it reaches a certain amount then we are going to apply this action. So let's look at cost and you can put it over here and we are saying that let's say I want to make sure that if the cost goes more than $5,000 then only we are going to apply this action. Next uh, you can also set the frequency as in do you want the rule to be running at the back end on a daily basis or a weekly monthly basis you can set that up over here and finally if you want a email to be sent you can choose that option from here if the rule is applied at or if you want when changes happen only then you want the email to come in you can set those settings out here once you create this you can save the rule and this rule will get implemented in the account and starts working at the back end. Let's look at a few more examples. Let's look at a rule related to budget. So for budgets as well as we know that budgets are applied at a campaign level. So we can choose campaign rules once again. And this time what I want is that I want to create a budget rule wherein uh, I want to increase my budget to a certain percentage. Uh, if the impression share loss due to budget is more than 70%. As we all understand, if the impression share loss is, is more than 70 or 50%, it means that the campaigns are losing potential, are not performing because of low budget. So for those specific campaigns, I want to make sure that the budgets are automatically increased by a certain percentage. So for that, you can create an automated rule over here. So in this case, the action which we will take into consideration would be change budgets. And here, as you can see, we can select the type of budget. So you're saying average daily budget. And what you want to do is you want to increase the budget. So you can increase it by percentage or by an amount. For now, I'm choosing by percentage. I'm saying I want to increase my budget by 5% if it meets the condition. At the same time, you also want to make sure that there is an upper cap to it as well. It should not be a case that it continues and to an amount which we really cannot pay. So we can put an upper limit. And now you can apply it to specific campaigns or to all the campaigns in the account. And here we're going to put the condition. So the condition was if the impression share lost due to budget is more than 70%, then we are applying this action. So we are going to look for impression share loss due to budget and we are saying if it is more than 70% then we are going to apply it 
Similarly, you can set the frequency. Do you want the rule to be applied on a daily basis? You can choose that from here or a weekly or a monthly. And if you want to receive emails, you can set up that setting as well over here. So this will be our budget rule, which will keep a check on all the campaigns where the impression share loss is, is hurting the campaign and we can make sure to increase the budget wherever we can. So now we have created this second rule. Moving on, let's look at another rule which can be around keywords. So I want to create a rule around keywords wherein I want to look at those keywords which are performing, which are getting me conversions. I want to increase their bids by a certain amount. At the same time, I want to also look at those keywords which are not getting me any conversions. I would like to go ahead and reduce their bids because they are not performing for my business. So let's look at how we can do this. So the first one I'm going to look at is the good keywords. So for that, I want to change the keyword bits, right? Okay, so we're going to set a new bits altogether. We're going to increase the bits by a certain percentage. Let's say I, want, I would increase it by 10% if there are keywords which are getting conversions. And for this again, I'm going to put an upper cap. Now this can be applied to all the keywords in the account or it can be for specific campaigns. So we can select that from here. And now here in the condition section, we're going to apply the condition. So the condition is that the conversions which we are getting over here is at least we are getting some conversions. So we can say more than zero. So if there are keywords which have conversions, at least one conversion, for those keywords, I will go ahead and increase the bits by, I want the system to automatically increase their bits by 10%, but don't, but they will never go beyond $20. Now you can go ahead and set up the frequency uh, on a daily basis or a weekly or a monthly basis. You can do that. And finally, you can do your email settings as well. So this will be a budget, a keyword rule uh, for the good keywords. And in the same manner, I can do uh, another rule for bad keywords, which are not performing for us. So let's have a look at that. We can choose the action in the same manner, which is changing the keyword bits. And we're going to set a new bid, but this time it will be decreasing the bits. And I'm saying that let's reduce their bits by 10%. But here also we have a limit which we are saying that the lowest it can go to is five dollars it will be applied to all the keywords in the account and now we are going to choose the same condition but this time what we are looking at is the conversions has to be less than we can say one which means there are no conversions and then the frequency you can set over here for this rule, which can be daily, once, weekly or monthly. And finally, the email settings. So this will be working towards our keywords. So now we have seen that we have created a campaign rule, budget rule. We have also looked at keywords. And now let's look at an ad rule. So with respect to ads, what I want to do is I want to check on those ads uh, which are not performing. So how do I decide that? So ads which are getting very less CTR and have uh, huge impressions, uh, they are, we can say that not performing for us, most probably they're irrelevant. So for such kind of ads, I want to create an automated rule wherein it will check these ads. And if we find any such ads which meeting our criteria, we would like to go ahead and pause them. So let's have a look at how we can do this. So we're going to create an ad rule and here the action would be we are pausing the ads and we'll apply it to all the ads in the account. The condition will be that first is the CTR we are saying over here is let's say less than 0.02% and we are putting another condition over here saying that the impressions which we get over here is very high. 
let's say thousand impressions so now these two conditions combine together when both the conditions are met only then those ads will be selected and they will be paused so now you can set up the frequency as well for it on a monthly daily weekly and once basis and you can do your email settings from here so this will be keeping a check on all my ads and pausing the low performing ads in the account in this simple manner guys we can create our automated rules which will continuously keep checking our campaigns changes at the back end and make those take those actions whenever required whenever we meet those specific settings or conditions i hope you are able to understand this and make use of it going forward if you have any questions related to it feel free to write in the comment section i would really happy to answer those guys thank you so much for today